Good morning, Grace Apostolic Church family and friends. I'm so happy to be here with you this morning. I hope you all are doing well. Um, this week, we are continuing our summer in the epistles, and this week we are going to be working on the book of Ephesians. So I hope that everybody has been enjoying um, the reading this summer so far, and um, I hope that this week you will enjoy the book of Ephesians. So today, I'm just going to talk a little bit about what um, the book of Ephesians is about, written by Paul to the church in Ephesus, and he is giving them some of the basics of basic Christian living. So chapters one through three, um, Paul reminds them that they, who they were before they knew Christ. And we all need that reminder. I'm so thankful every day that I can look back and I can remember the person that I was and look at the person I am today and only because of Jesus Christ in my life. And I'm so thankful for that. And Paul reminds them of who they were and reminds them that they need to be thankful for who they are now because of God's grace and mercy that he has shown to them. And we all need that reminder. Then he goes on to speak about unity in the church and that it is what will bring unity to our world. So he reminds them that they need to be unified amongst one another and how important that is to the continuing of the gospel. And he makes it very clear that Christ is the head of the church. And I'm so glad that I go to a church that Christ is the head and he is the center of all that we do. And I'm so thankful for that today. He also likens the church to the body of Christ and that we need to be the hands and the feet of Jesus Christ for this world. And we also need to be the mouth that is spreading the gospel to the world. And he ends with preparing the church of, in Ephesus for a battle. And we are in a battle today. And in chapter six of verse 12 in, of, of Ephesians, it says, for we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but, about, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. We are in a battle today, but God has prepared us and given us the whole armor of God that we might stand against the wiles of the devil. And in, in, in chapter six of Ephesians, Paul finishes with talking about the whole armor of God and the importance to Christians to wear that whole armor of God and the importance of putting that on every day when we wake up and fighting the battle. But saints, we can win and we do win in the end. So I, I'm so excited um, for this summer and we have great things coming up at the Grace Apostolic Church. Our family night is coming up. But this week, I hope that you enjoy reading and will be encouraged by the word of God. And I pray that each of you have a blessed week.